there, it's Wendy here from You Dream Big and WendyBottrell.com. And you know, we've been working at home for many years now, and we personally feel it's the best way to work. It's also been said that in the beginning, when people start to work at home or start to think about working at home, um, they have many challenges and certainly with productivity is a big one. So today our topic is adopt these four tips for more work at home productivity this year. What we know is that more and more countries and therefore more and more people around the world uh, are being hired out as remote workers or people working at home or large corporations um, having people work at home. And it may leave you asking if you know, you'd be able to truly be productive if you had to work at home or if you want to work at home. So these are great questions to ask, especially before you start a new business or a job um, that may be required that you uh, are productive uh, at home. So uh, our first idea or tip, uh, you must develop the skill of discipline. Uh, and a lot of people right away um, may turn off, but keep an open mind. Discipline is actually quite a freeing thing. It's not, um, and it's not difficult when you get into the practice of developing the skill. The biggest aspect of being able to be productive when working at home really is the skill of discipline. Discipline means you must be able to work even when someone isn't standing over your shoulder, and policing your breaks. It's uh, really just about knowing what you have to do and get on it right away using discipline. This independence can be a challenge in the beginning. Uh, for someone who finds themselves constantly drifting into the kitchen for an extra snack or wanting to check the score of the latest game on the TV. We did write a blog post on uh, uh, on the practice of discipline and we'll share that uh, link in the show notes. Uh, it has some more helpful tips for you. Uh, certainly uh, be sure to share any of your ideas, questions or comments below and you know let us know how we can help you. Our second tip is you must have a separate workplace. When it comes from working at home You'll never be productive if you're, you know, lying on the couch or working at the kitchen table. The fridge and the TV are just too strong of distractions. It would help if you created a separate workspace. It doesn't have to be a full office, but at least a desk in a room or an area uh, where you can close the door to keep out the distractions. And many years ago, I lived in a fairly small apartment where there was no room for a separate office space. So I went out and got uh, one of those one piece uh, furniture, looked like a clothes wardrobe. And when you opened it up, it was actually a perfect home office and had computer filing, a place for writing. It was actually a fantastic way to work at home in a small space. And I definitely, um, put that to great use in my practice at being disciplined at working from home. So know what helps you focus. One thing about working from home is that you won't have the office environment to help shift and keep your focus when it's time to get the work done. Therefore, you have to have an idea what environment uh, you work and focused in best. So what are your strengths when it comes to focus? working on time schedules and discipline. Figuring those things out, you can create the same environment at home. Once you figure this out, you'll have no problem keeping on task and being productive while you're doing your job at home or building your business. Have fewer distractions during the work hours at home. You know, um, if your spouse and yourself and the kids and everybody's at home, it can be very difficult uh, with all the distractions. So the final issue is going to be working at home if there are distractions that you're exposed to. So if it's simply a noisy neighborhood uh, that may be the problem for you, you know, then maybe a white noise machine 
I play uh, binaural beats or classical music in the background and that does drown, drown out any of the neighborhood noise. Uh, as I say, if your partner, kids work at home as well, this can create a problem uh, when you have to focus on a, a task at hand. You'll want to know how you can work around this and uh, be sure that you can work without constant interruptions. So figuring it out with the family, certain hours um, where everyone has to be a, a, a lot quieter, um, study time, kids playing outside and so forth. So there's many ways to do it, uh, but again, it's what works for you. So can I be productive working at home? And overall, we say yes, definitely. Now it can be difficult to judge in advance if you will be productive when working at home. As long as you have a place, a plan, and low level of distractions, it's highly likely that you'll be able to work product productively at home without an issue. And you may find that there will be some experimentations, but don't give up too quick. Um, put your plan together figure out those things that will be the biggest distractions and eliminate them first or eliminate them as best you can and then as you go you will develop more and more ideas for yourself uh, what will work for you. So we want to thank you for connecting. Uh, please like and share this uh, information. We do invite you to subscribe to our channel. My name is Wendy Bottrell. You can find out more about us at youdreambig.com or wendybottrell.com. Thanks. Bye now.